So first of all, next Monday we have a holiday, right? Right? What what's the purpose of that holiday? What, <laughs> anyone know? Mid Autumn Festival, right? The Moon Festival, right? Very good. This is one point. Okay. The Moon Festival actually happens on this Sunday. Okay, but but okay so here, but when but for this year, if the holiday is on Sunday, then we should have uh, a substitute holiday on Monday. Okay, so this is one reason. Another reason? Very good, Teacher's Day. Okay, why, 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 why is it a Teacher's Day on this day? Anyone know? Very good, it's Conf Confucius' birthday. Okay, according to some genius, I don't know how he or she can calculate his exact birthday to be September the 28th. Because Confucius, this Kongzi, okay, he, he lived more than, okay, at uh, around 550. So he, he was born at, if my memory is correct, so I checked the Wikipedia. <laughs> so, so uh, somehow, this is his, the year that he's born. And according to some calculation, he's born in this day, okay? Okay, so that's why, that's why uh, it is the birthday. Okay, so, so Confucius is a great teacher, and he has many saying, and and one of them, I think it is very, so I learned it very, I heard of it very, when I was a kid, but I don't know the meaning. Let's see if you can tell me. What, are there anyone here who doesn't know Chinese character? No? Good, okay. So let's see if you have seen this before. <laughs> you have seen this, right? Okay. So there are too many meaning here because Confucius is dead for a long time, okay? <laughs> okay, so this is from his book, okay? So this is by Kongzi. Okay, so there are two, two Verb here, so so it's about how how we sh how how we can study well. So we need to learn, and we also need to think. Okay, if we just learn but not think, bad. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then if you think, and not learn, a uh, bad. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So there are a lot of yeah. So so somehow some people have different meaning associated with this one. This looks like. Uh, this looks like this one, right? So it seems that you will be confused, okay, but, okay. And then this one, there are uh, different people have different meanings. Someone says, okay, uh, you will be dangerous. Okay, dangerous maybe because you just uh, think, you do not learn. You, you don't know whether you are doing things that previous people has done. So you are doing, reinventing things, maybe you are you are in a, a bad position to, to learn new things. Okay, it's not like, it's like building a, building a house over the sand rather than concrete, okay. And some people say, okay, maybe this means stop. You, 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 don't, you don't have much improvement. And maybe someone says, this one is a, a word that also means, so may have uh, the same meaning as, uh, as you are having doubt. You don't know what's going on, similar thing. But because there are so many different meanings, let's say this is bad, okay? So here, using logic that we have, so what, so it is, if we learn, this is learn, right? But then, and you do not think, then it means bad. Oh. Bad thing will happen. And similarly, if you do not learn, and only think this is bad, okay. So what is the conclusion? The conclusion, it seems that it is, uh, we should learn and we should think, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but then we got into a logic trap. It doesn't imply that. If you want to be good, then either you should 
learn and think, or do not learn and do not think. <laughs> <laughs> OK. So, so of course, I guess, OK, we should have a, have, have a, we should have that to study well, we have to learn. So this has to be true, OK, somehow. Eh? Maybe, I don't know. OK, so this is something, something that, OK, so, so why am I saying this? OK, because that means that we have a long holiday. Assignment 1 is already out. Uh, we don't have a deadline yet. But assignment one, they are, uh, it, it is uh, covering the materials in lecture one and lecture two. So you may take a look, and then I guess you can finish at least half of it by yourself. Or with some of the questions are very challenging. Okay, it needs time to think. You can also discuss with your friends and then to do that. Okay, good. Another thing that I want to mention is, so we haven't, so today, today is also very special. What is, have you, have you ever searched Use Google already today. Okay, if you search Google, use Google to search things today, you see a lot of fruits or whatever thing. Because today is the first day of autumn. Autumn. So this is in Chinese. This is this one. Okay. So if you okay, this is Chinese. Okay, but in in Western culture, then we have the zodiac sign. There are 12 signs, like Baiyang uh, Zhou, uh, Jin Liu Zhou. Okay, so today is also the separation okay, between, between the Virgo, Shi Ni Zhou, or Chu Ni Zhou, and Libra, the Tian, tian Chen. Okay, so for this one, this one, how do we determine this day? Is it based on the sun or based on the moon? Moon. moon. Uh, if you think it is about moon, could you please raise your hand? If you think it is about sun, could you please raise your hand? It turns out that it is sun. Okay, so you expect that. So all, there are 24 special days, and then it is actually based on sun, Qingming. Okay, so there is a, 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 a poem that captures all these 24 uh, jieqi. <laughs> okay, so some of them are based on Sun, some of them are based on moon. So the Mid-Autumn Festival is based on, you can say some, some sun and some moon, okay, because it is always, always around nearly the same period, around the same period, and then, but then you need the full moon, okay. But there is one special holiday in the Western culture that depends on both sun and moon. It is the Easter holiday. Uh, Easter, 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 anyone know Easter? Easter, Easter is to 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 memorize the 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 reincarnation or the Jesus die and then reborn. Okay, so uh, okay, so come yes, okay, yes. <laughs> so there's Easter, and then when when is Easter designed? Uh, de defined, <coughs> roughly speaking, Easter is defined based on the sun first. So we have uh, this not Ni Chun. It is the This, this date, this date is around March the 21st. Okay, this is the day that the sun goes to the equator. So we will have at the same hours of uh, sunlight and the same hours of day and the same hours of night. Okay, so it goes to the, 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 the equator. Okay, so from this one, you look at the day again and again to find the first full moon. Okay, so this now suddenly it goes back to the moon. Okay, so you start from this day to look forward. Which day gives you the first full moon? And then what? And then from this full moon day, you find the Sunday. Because Easter is always on Sunday, right? Okay, so, so, the, so, so it is defined as the first, full, uh, the first Sunday after the first full moon, that is after this, this day, March the 21st. So this is a very interesting one. And so people find it very hard to calculate it year by year. But, but Euler did that very, very, very well. OK, okay so that's the end for today's lecture. So, so OK, let's meet again.